be able to show you this. We have not had a proper sunrise in whew, all week. I get very sad when there's not sunshine. And so today is definitely going to have loads and loads and loads of sunshine, which makes me really, really happy. It's going to make the wildlife happy. It's going to make the grass and the trees happy. And I'm hoping it's going to make you happy as well. So all of those beautiful colors, the sherbets, the orange, the, the pinks, mm, what a way to start the day. That and the lion roars. So I was in the car park with Steve this morning when the lions were roaring and it was also making my day. And I'm happy that we managed to find him, or I should say Steve managed to find him for all of you so that you guys could see that beautiful Avoca male. Now I've got a little surprise for you on foot. We have the tallest land mammal in the world busy watching us, asking us what what are we up to? We also have some elephants who have decided that they want to join our party. So we are going to take a little walk this way. I'm going to let you see the giraffe first. A little bit of kissed golden light. And then we're going to start making our approach towards those elephants. Now, as we make the approach towards the elephants, I'm not going to be talking. And the reason why I'm not going to be talking is that we're going to approach as quietly as we possibly can. So similar to what we were doing yesterday with our leopard tracking, you guys are going to come along. You're going to be participants with us on this walk. We also have some wildebeest photobombing us. And we're going to go really quietly into the bushes just over here. Are you ready? So come walk along beside me. We've got Morris here as well. We're going to make our way towards this large marula and then towards that termite mound. Come walk beside me, guys. Walk beside me. Walk beside me. Trish, you're wondering if elephants ever kill babies. Trish, I've only experienced that once. There was a female at the age of nine years old who gave birth. She's a little bit too young to give birth. The rest of the herd did kill that baby eventually um and that I've, that's the only time i've ever heard that happening but as we're busy approaching you guys are walking along right beside me all right i'm just gonna stay really quiet and we get till we get towards the elephants okay come with me That was my fault. I didn't give him enough space. So we're going to give him a little bit more space.
All right, guys. Well, I'm busy trying to find these elephants for you. Let's head on over to Steve to see what he's up to.